שבת שלום. שבת שלום. חג שמח. It is שמיני עצרת, the eighth day of stopping. God wanted us to stop and look around. Everybody look what's going down. This is the end of these holidays. But we go out with simcha and joy and gratitude. That's what we're doing here this evening. So we have a blessing. We have a blessing for everything, but we have a blessing for you who came this evening, and especially you who ascend to the Torah tonight as B'nai Mitzvah. This is the blessing we give you. May your eyes sparkle with the light of Torah, and may your ears hear the music of its words. May the space between each letter of the scrolls bring warmth and happiness to your soul. May the syllables draw holiness from your heart, and may this holiness be gentle and soothing to you and all of God's creatures. What a beautiful blessing. And in this moment, all we can do is thank God for this light, the light that, the light that diminishes the darkness, any darkness we may have known, particularly the light that comes vis-a-vis the Torah, by virtue of what we learn and grow and stretch ourselves to become, always growing, always learning, even at the age of anywhere between 30 and 80, yes, you too can learn and grow and stretch. And sometimes it's painful, but mostly it brings more light to the world. That's what we have here tonight with our B'nai Mitzvah. And we make this blessing with our cantor, cantor Batami Moses, who has put so much love and joy and soul, always her wonderful neshama, along with Beata Abraham, our educator, to create a moment that will be remembered, but even more that will infuse us with the light to carry on into this Shabbat, this Chag, and this year. So Beata, I would like to invite you now as we light our Shabbat and holiday candles to light together and lead us in the beautiful blessing. My pleasure. I invite everyone to join me in saying the bracha on Shabbat candle. Baruch atah Adonai Eloheinu melech haolam asher kiddushanu b'mitzvotav v'tzivanu Lehadlik ner shel Shabbat vishel yom tov. Amen. There's a lot of light in this Zoom room tonight, in our holy sanctuary, wherever we are. Beautiful. Amen. And now, friends, this evening we are blessed. As you'll see, we'll have special B'nai Mitzvah giving what's called Devar Tfilah which is words of prayer, words that they have studied, each of these tefillot, each of these prayers, and will share a bit of their journey as they become bar and bat mitzvah tonight. So the rabbi and I are going to take a little step back tonight as we have beautiful, sacred, spiritual leaders to help us with our simcha. I invite Kathy and Tamarack to lead us in the Barhu. When I hear the Nigun, the wordless melody that leads us into the Barhu prayer, it invokes a very special memory for me on my journey to choosing Judaism. After months of study and attending services, this special moment arrived while I was singing the Nigun at services on a Friday night. At the end of the Nigun, hearing the call of the Barhu, I was filled with joy and peace as the Baruch Hu response filled, spilled from my lips in Hebrew with understanding of what I was singing and unity with all who were around me. And in that moment, we were all one, and I knew I was now part of this community. I had found my spiritual home. Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat Shalom. My personal journey with God was a struggle in where I often felt spiritually alone and isolated. But all our journeys are unique, and the Barhu, as we bow together, our individual journeys can fade into a communal connection 
And as we rise, we create a space which praises God in a collective way forward. And as we foster this connection, we can discover we are not alone. Beautiful. Please rise. Suzanne Greenbaum. Oh, friends, you might want to pin your screen right on our little Zoom room so you can see who's presenting. You can pin the speaker. I guess it's speaker view. Okay. Shabbat Shalom, everyone. Hama Ariv is the daily prayer that centers around God's mingling of the darkness and the light. Thy darkness is adversity and my light is hope. I connect very deeply to this prayer as it is a constant reminder of my illness, multiple sclerosis. With MS, it can be easy to let the darkness, the fear, anxiety, and physical pain overtake my daily life. But I choose to focus on the light, my family, my friends, my faith, and my community. Studying for my bat mitzvah has taught me to try to envision the brighter side. My cup should be full, not half empty. Amen. Shabbat shalom. Baruch atah Adonai Amari varavim. You know, every single one of our friends tonight has studied a little Devar la a little bit of Torah that pertains to the part of the service that they're going to be introducing. And the depth and the spirit. I hope you can learn something about these people that you may not have known before. What light resides within. Source of life every year you plant within us a new tree of life. May it be your will that this year our Torah blossoms with kindness and not cruelty, wisdom and not foolishness, awareness and not thoughtlessness. May you teach us a Torah of love, God, that will nourish us in every season. So friends, this is a prelude to our Shema prayer of beautiful peace that uh, one of our bat mitzvah tonight shared with me. And just give me one moment to find the music here and then we'll be back with the words If you're lost and feel afraid and you don't know what to say, then listen, listen to your God. Is there a question on your mind? Is the answer hard 
to find. Then listen, listen to our God. Listen with all your heart and soul, and with all your might. Write them and learn them and teach them well, every morning and night. Close your eyes and listen. Judy? Are you there, my friend? I apologize. No. Shabbat Shalom. The Shema in prayers and is considered by some the most essential prayer in all of Judaism. As I recite this prayer, I open my eyes in the morning and close them at night and become a witness to the oneness of God. There is a fullness and a contentment to my entire being. Having experienced both great joy and deep despair, this prayer has become an anchor for my soul and the mitzvah I have been searching for to fulfill my entire life. As I become a bat mitzvah today, I reclaim my Hebrew name, Sharon Yehudit, and I'm proud to lead you in reciting the Shema, the most powerful of all Jewish prayers. Shema Yisrael, Adonai Eloheinu, Adonai Echad. Baruch Shem Kevod Mahuto Leolam Vahed. Avi? Shabbat Shalom, everyone. Uh, words, what these words are saying to my heart, if following the Shema, now that I have your attention, here is my expectation of you. You will love your God with all your heart, soul, and fiber that is within you. And if you do this, you will be a person that pursues Torah, performs acts of kindness, and passes these teachings unto your children. It is the words from this prayer which have inspired me to teach Sunday school at Temple Israel. My hope is connect, my hope is to connect with the hearts of the young as well as my own, and with the heart of Judaism, which is found between the beginning and the end, or the end and the beginning. 
of Torah. In passing on the words of the Torah to my students and by studying its commandments, I follow the direction of the Vahat Torah prayer to impress upon our children the emotional and intellectual lessons of how to love God. It is amazing what you can learn by teaching others. Bat shalom, everyone. Join me. Eight Adonai Elohecha, Behole of Ha, Behon of Shecha, Vokome Odeha, Veha you had a remaile, a share on Ochim, it's of Ha, a yom, a leva verha, Veshinatam, Levanecha, Vibarta, Bam, Veshitaha, Bebetaha, Uvlatha, Vaderech, Ushopeha, Ukumeha, Ukshartam. Od al yadecha ve yuletot afod bene necha uchtab tam amizuzot betecha uvi sharecha lema antiskeru vasitem et kol mitzvotai vitem kiroshim leloechem ani adonai eloechem asher hotzeti etchem meretz mitzrayim liod lachem lelohim ani Adonai Elohechem. Amen. I forgot to unmute. There you are. <laughs> Shalom. I'm so glad that I grew up when I did because I never learned Hebrew and we said the Vahavta in English. So I had the opportunity to learn this special prayer and understand it. This prayer says that we should love God completely and teach this love to others. Make this love part of your life and how you live each day. I've always... No. No. I've always known that I am Jewish but never really understood what that meant. I went to temple and I read the prayers, but never really knew what they meant to me. Then as an adult, I took the Melton classes in Jewish studies, when I, which started me on my journey. During this period, I was fortunate enough to have found rabbi, a rabbi and a teacher that brought me home to my Judaism in Rabbi Mars. After a very serious automobile accident, she reawakened my Jewish identity by starting with a naming ceremony. Rabbi has helped me to connect with God and feel that I am part of the whole. She encouraged me back to Temple Israel and that really was coming home. For the first time I became part of a community and knew that I belonged. Everything, I was becoming, everything was becoming clear to me about my connection with God and I was able to share these feelings. And I can thank the people that have been on this journey with me. Shabbat Shalom. Adonai Eloechem Emet. Tara. Shabbat Shalom. Miha Mocha. These were the words Miriam sang as our people crossed the Red Sea to escape Egypt. She brought out her tambourine in joyous celebration to an excited but scared people. Miriam has always spoken to me personally as my Hebrew name is Miriam. I relate to her on so many aspects, but it is here as she is leading the people to join together and move forward that I connect to her the most. When I was younger, I always felt as though I was racing to find God, but the finish line kept moving. When I became part of the Jewish people, it was the first time I felt God was next to me, walking with me, working with me to build and create the world. Miha Mocha reminds us that every day we must choose to leave our own Egypt and walk with God to Tikkun Olam, repairing the world we want to live in.
מרכיב פתאום את בית יעקב, וגאלו מיד חזק ממנו, ברוך אתה אדוני, גאל ישראל. פאלה קופמן Nohash Kiveinu is a prayer of petition to God, asking to be shielded from sickness and from danger. It requests from God to shelter us in peace through the night so that we may rise up to renewed life and peace in our homes and in our hearts. I deeply relate to this prayer as its theme is a constant in my life. While I'm continually grateful for the blessings in my life, I'm also very much aware of the struggles of people who are in need of shelter and peace. Throughout my life, I've been called to action to bring comfort, healing, and peace to those in need with whatever power I possess. I've prayed to be given the strength to work towards spreading peace in our homes, our community, and our world. As a bat mitzvah today, I continue to embrace the commandment of tikkun olam and continue to dedicate myself to repairing the world. Hashkivenu Adonai Eloheinu Neshalom Ha'amidenu Shomre Hashkivenu Adonai Eloheinu Lechadom Ha'amidenu Shomreinu Lechaim Hashkivenu Adonai Eloheinu Lechadom Ha'amidenu Shomreinu Shabbat Shalom, everyone. With the Vishamru prayer, we are commanded to protect and observe the Sabbath. This prayer really resonates for me. Finding meaning in Shabbat has been a grounding force in my Jewish journey. You see, I didn't grow up in a traditional Jewish home, and I was not surrounded by a loving Jewish community. So I've made it a point to actively seek out a Jewish life and nurture my Jewish identity. Lighting the Shabbat candles reminds me of all that is good in the world and it illuminates my Jewish experience. I have always loved the journey metaphor and traveling this road has led me here to Temple Israel and to all of you. Poetry and song has always helped me in my journey. So I'd like to close with the words of Paul McCartney. The long and winding road that leads to your door will never disappear. I've seen that road before, and it always leads me here. Lead me to your door. Shabbat Shalom, everyone. Shabbat Shalom. And I'm tempted to sing that song instead of Vishamru right now. <laughs> On John Lennon's birthday at that too, you know. So, <laughs> well, in honor of Paul McCartney and John Lennon and the the holy music of the Beatles, we will sing Vishamru together. Vishamru b'nei
we say this special special passage for Simchat Torah. Vedaber Moshe et Moade Adonai El Bene Yisrael. Joy. Eternal God, open up my lips that my mouth may declare your glory. This is the prelude to the central prayer of our service, the Amida, and comes from the book of Psalms. There is special choreography associated with the verse that reflects both humility and chutzpah. The thought of standing before the Eternal One surely demands humility. We take two steps back. But our chutzpah propels us toward the encounter, so we take not two, but three steps forward, then bow, acknowledging before whom we stand. Eternal God, open up my lips. Helps me declare that I am dependent on God for my life and the ability to effectively use my body and mind. As a witness to creation and as a member of humanity, which is the only segment of God's creation, who can acknowledge and sanctify God's work, I utter the phrase that my mouth may declare your glory. Beautiful. And if you feel compelled to rise now, please rise as we sing these words that Joy just so beautifully described. Also, if you want to be seated in quiet contemplation, that's the, God, the language God understands as well. But join us in this special Amidah for this evening. Adonai sifatai tiptach ufi agita hilatecha. Adonai, open up my lips that my mouth may declare your praise. Baruch ata Adonai, Eloheinu, Velohe avotinu vimoteinu, Elohe Avraham, Elohe Yitzchak, Velohe Yaakov, Elohe Sara, Elohe Rivka, Elohe Rachel, Velohe Lea, Ha'el Hagadol, Hagibor, Hanora, El El Yom, Gomel Chasadim Tovim, Vekone Hakol, Vizocher Chasay Avot, Vimahot, Ume Vigula, Livne Venehem, Leban Shemo, Behava. Melech Ozer Umoshia Umagain, Baruch Ata Donai, Magin Abraham, Bezrat Sara Atagi Bole Lama Donai, Mechaye Hakol Atarav Lehoshia, Mashi Parubach Umorid Hagashem, Mechakel Chayim Bechesed, Mechaye Hakol Berachamim Rabim, Somech Noflim Verofe Holim, Umatir Asurim, Umekaye Memunato Lishene Afar, Mirhamocha Bagibu Rot, Umidomelach, Melech may meet Umecha. Umat miach Yeshua, v'neeman ata lahagayot hakol. Baruch ata Adonai, mechaye hakol. Special insertion here of in Atzeret Simchat Torah blessing. Remember those whose hearts poured out to you like water as we make this prayer for Geshem, for, for water, for rain, who trusted that the journey would lead to you. We say together, for Abraham and Sarah's faith, do not withhold water. Remember the ch one chosen for her words, please take some water. And remember the one whose blood almost spilled like water. For Rebecca and Isaac's righteousness, grant water. Remember how Jacob crossed the river to wrestle in the waters of his conscience, Recall the sisters' tears, their waters of birth, their tents of peace. For Jacob, Rachel, and Leah fill the earth with needed water. For blessing and not for curse. For life and not death. 
for abundance, not want. Baruch atah Adonai ha'el ha'kadosh. You've chosen us in love and favor by making us holy through your mitzvot commandments and drawing us close to your service, that through us your great and holy name may become known in all the earth. In your love, Adonai, our God, you have given us Shabbatot of rest, feasts of gladness, and seasons of joy, this Shabbat day and this festival of Atzeret Simchat Torah, season of rejoicing, to unite in worship and recall the Exodus from Egypt. We now welcome Paula Weinstein. Shabbat Shalom. The word Shalom is said to appear 237 times in the Bible, and in addition to meaning peace, it can also represent health, welfare, completeness, and safety. When asked what Osei Shalom meant to me, the lines of the Christmas song, let there be peace on earth and let it begin with me, was my first thought. It caused me to do my part for a peaceful world by doing the right thing, especially when no one is looking, to work for social justice and to be kind, caring, and helpful to others, whether friends, family, or strangers. Let's all sing together. Oh, say shalom in Roma. Adonai, Hamivarach et Amo Yisrael, We now come to our Torah service, and we'll have two aliyot tonight. Um, it's, it's not typically our tradition at Temple Israel to read Torah on Friday nights, but we're taking this opportunity and making the most of Simchas Torah by taking out the Torah. We have two Sifrei Torah, two scrolls tonight, one housed at my house since I think a month and a half ago or so, and one housed at Cantor Moses' home. Um, we've been keeping, keeping them safe. One is rolled, the first one is rolled to the very end of the Torah, the book of Deuteronomy, where Moses, Moshe has met the end of his life, and there's never been a Navi like him, there's never been a prophet like him, never was, never will be another like him. But we aspire to be like Moses, to be able to accept um, uh, those things that are difficult for us, and then to realize that we can run, run to the next part of the scroll. You have to end at Deuteronomy to be able to start back up the gray sheet at Genesis. So that's when we come upon hope again, and we come upon a beginning. And that beginning is in my house with the beginning of Sefer Breshit. So we had take special pains. Um, an ordinary Simchat Torah, if we were all in shul together, all in the same space, we would have a special, um, a special aliyah for the end of Deuteronomy and a special aliyah for the beginning of Genesis. And we'll do that tonight, splitting up our wonderful class of B'nai Mitzvah and um, having part of them do the end of one of the, the end of the scroll and part of them um, blessing the beginning of the, um, the other scroll. So we are um, all using our imaginations, friends. And I have to tell you that this conversation has lit like well, I hate to say, like wildfire around the country in, in, in terms of um, Jewish educators and rabbis and cantors and 
all kinds of people trying to figure out how do we make Simchat Torah really work? This is our solution to it. And we all have to imagine ourselves dancing with the scroll tonight. Um, thank you, B'nai Mitzvah students, because you know, you like Rabbi Akiva, Rabbi Akiva was 39 years old when he discovered that he did not know any Torah. He didn't even know the Aleph Bet, the alphabet. Um, but then he turned 40 and something really big happened for him. He came into his own. He began to see that Torah was right within his sight. He could grab it. He could take hold of it. It was his. And soon he became a sage, a teacher. And that's the inspiration we take from all of you. You have shown us that you can learn and now you can teach. You have shown us that we can share this blessing with you and through your own learning and growth and daring, you have shown us that you can model how we can live and how we can always aspire to learn more. So with that, we come to the beginning of our Torah service. The ark is opened. Ein kamocha velohim Adonai Vein kamasecha Malchutacha malchut kol olamim Umemshatacha v'chol dor v'ador Adonai melech, Adonai malach Adonai yimloch leolam v'ahed Adonai oz leamo yitain Adonai yivarech et amo v'ashad Shalom, avarachamim, etiva virtzon chaesion, tivni chomot Yerushalayim, tivni chomot Yerushalayim, ki v'chol levad batachnu, melech eram v'nisa adon olamim. Join me. Ki bitzion tetze Torah, ki bitzion tetze Torah, udevar Adonai mi Yerushalayim, Baruch shenatan Torah, Torah, Baruch shenatan Torah, Torah, Leobo Yisrael, Let's all read together the special passage we say on our festival evenings. Let's read together in English. Adonai, Adonai, a God compassionate and gracious, slow to anger, abounding in kindness and faithfulness, extending kindness to the thousandth generation, forgiving iniquity, transgression and sin, and granting pardon. And you'll all repeat after me. Shema Yisrael, Adonai Eloheinu, Adonai Echad. Shema Yisrael, Adonai Eloheinu, Gadol Adonai Kadosh Shemo And we add a special hakafa, which means a dancing, a circle. When we ask, please deliver us, God, please sustain us, answer on this day that we call upon you. Elohe Arucho Toshiana. Now you sing Hoshiana. Now you sing and now, as we put our Sifrei Torah down, and while we're singing Torah, 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 um, we invite now, summoning the Chatan Kalat Torah for the end of the Torah, as this holiday is all about endings and beginnings. When God literally closes one book of the Torah, God opens another. And so for this Aliyah, for our Chatan and Kalat Torah, we call up, 
Tamarack, Kathy, Suzanne, Judy, and Avi. And we have a special blessing, a special way that you're called up. So be ready. And here we go. <laughs> Mer shoot hella gadola ki porvana ra, u mer shoot mi paz, u mi pini mi kara, ef tak pi beshira u vizira, le hodod le halel le dar, bin hora shehechi anu ve kim anu ve gianu, li smoch besimcha hatora. Ya am du, ya am du, chatan ve kalatara. And friends, when you are ready for your aliyah, achad, shtaim, shalosh. Baruch Adonai on Baruch Leolam Ba'ed Baruch Adonai on Baruch Adonai on Baruch Adonai on Baruch Amen. Velo kam navi od be Yisrael ki Moshe Asher yada Adonai panim el. Panim lechol haotot vehamoftim asher shelacho Adonai laasod beeretz mitzrayim lefaro ulechol avadav ulechol artzo ulechol hayar hachazaka ulechol hamora hagadol asher asamoshe leeni. Kod Yisrael. Judy, you want to take yourself off mute for the blessing after the Torah? Go ahead. Amen. As you see, friends, when we finish the entire Torah, books of the Torah, but also we just finished the whole Torah, we chant together. Chazak, chazak, venit hazeg. Be strengthened, be strengthened. Mazel tov. And now for our next aliyah, we start right at the beginning. The rabbi's already there, and we call up Joy and Paula, Amy, Lynn, and Tara, and Paula. And here is your special chatan, or kalatot, I should say, berry sheet. Mer shoot, ah, cobra chavishira, umer shoot, chavarot serek eta hoba ushura, kvut sim pa, hayam le sim chatora, venet sarim le sayem, ula hachel, begil uv mora. Tom to Kalata Tara. Paula, Paula, beautiful. Let every let's everyone do it together. Ready? Time shallow. Baruch Adonai Hambarach Leolam Ba'ed Baruch Adonai Hambarach Leolam Ba'ed Baruch 
Now, before we put our Sifre Torah back into our ark, tonight we give a special Misha Berach. Usually we think of the Misha Berach prayers just for those who need healing, but Misha Berach means those who are blessed. May the one who bless. So tonight, I want everyone, all of our incredibly spiritual and beautiful, learned B'nai Mitzvah to rise where you are right now and receive this blessing. I'm going to chant it in Hebrew and the rabbi will read your blessing to you in English. כל אנשים באו פוש לכם לקבור המקום ולקבור התורה. ביזכר זה הקדוש ברוך הוא ישמריהם ויצליהם מכל צרה וצוקה מכל נגד ומחלה וישלח ברכה והצלחה בכל מעשה ידיהם עם כל ישראל ונאמר אמן. Amen. May the one who blessed our ancestors, Abraham, Isaac, Jacob, Sarah, Yifka, Rachel, Valeya, bless all of these children, <laughs> of all of their parents, all the spirits that brought them to be on this earth, all of those nishamot, those holy, those holy vessels that made possible these special people. They have come to the Torah in honor of God and mitzvot and Torah. And may they merit from the Holy One of Blessing every protection. God rescue them from any trouble or distress and from any illness, minor or serious. May you send blessing and success in their direction, God, in every endeavor, together with all of Israel. And we all say from every screen and every home and every capacity we have to give a virtual hug, Amen. Amen. And of course, while we do have our Sifre Torah out, we also include a bracha for healing. And um, I'm going to ask you, friends, we, we do have our Misha Berach list, and I will pause for you to put um, your the names of people for whom you're wishing healing into the chat box. So please, please do so now, and then I'm going to um, say our all too long list of, um, of beloved people in our congregation and in our hearts who are sick. We wish them every grace and every healing. 
מי שבירך אבותינו ואימותינו, אברהם, יצחק ויעקב, שרה רבקה רחל ולאה, הוא יברך וירת מאת החולים. דניאל בן כרמלה, כרמלה בת סילביה ומק, שרגה בן אלכסנדר, יעקב יצחק בן דוד ורחב, אליהו בן שרה, הרב ראובן שלמה בן מנדל ולאה, נעמי בת מרים והרב יוסף, גיטל בת יהודה וחיה, זסלחנה בת יצא רבקה, לביאה בת רחל, גבריאלה בת נחמיה ודבורה, ירמיהו בן יוסף ורחל, סנדר בן שרה, נורמה אגרנוף, בב ארנסון, ברברה במגרנר, פאט קודל, ג'ים קונלי, לילי קוביץ, ברי קרייג, איזבל פזון, לארי פוטר, אלי גינס, ג'יין הוקר, קישה האצ'נס, איתן קדיש, רות קאן, דיל מקילינג'ר, לינדה מנדל, ויליאם נולן, אנתוני פאנת, קלארק פאטן, הלין פסלניק, קאסי ראש, ליסה שור, בן סיימן, דוג סטוסל, ג'ף סוורטס, לי טננבאום, אנט טרנר, every single person that you just listed in our chat box and every single human being who is suffering from any kind of malady of the heart, body, or soul. HaKadosh Baruch Hu Yimale Rachamim Aleihem Lachalimam Ulura Pe'otam Ula HaChazikam Yishlach Lahem Mehera Rifuah Rifuah Shlema Mina Shamaim Rifuah Tanefesh Rifuah Taguf Shabbati Milisok Hashtabagala Ubizman Kari Venomar Amen. Wish them every healing. As we put our Sefer Torah away, we remember that the Torah is a tree of life. With roots and with watering and care, we grow like the Torah grows in us. And so we've seen tonight in our B'nai Mitzvah. <laughs> It is our great, great pleasure to give all the B'nai Mitzvah the priestly blessing. And I just want to say on behalf of um, the cantor and myself and Beata Abraham, our educator, um, it probably wasn't easy getting up even an hour earlier on for shul. Um, all those months when we used to go to shul, um, but also just, you know, the, the mere fact that during COVID, all of these students stuck with the program and, and life happens. And actually we, we, we have a few beloved friends who couldn't join us and it's not for not trying. It's just that life caught up. So we, we, you know, this is, this is like why Torah and the Jewish people, um, inspire us because there's something about the stamina there's something about the endurance that it takes to live life. And, and we just all come with this bona fide blessing of nothing but koach, real power to you. When we say yashar koach, it is straight to you with power that we wish this. And, and so I just want to say on behalf of your teachers, what a, what a real bracha it has been. And all three of us give you this blessing now. Yivarech Adonai v'yishmerecha. May God bless you and keep you. Yoher Adonai panav elecha v'yichunecha. May God's light shine upon you and may God be gracious to you. 
יפסה אדוני פניו אליך, ויישם לך שדום. May you feel God's presence within you always, and may you find peace. אמן. Please rise for עלינו. עלינו לשבח לאדון הכל, לתת גדולה ליוצא בראשית, שהוא נוטה שמיים ויוסד ארץ, או יקרו בשמיים ממעל, ושכינה תוזו בגובהי מרומים, ואלוהינו אין עוד, ואנחנו קוראים ומשתחווים ומודים, לפני מלך מלכי המלכים, הקדוש ברוך הוא. ונה... נאמר, והיה אדוני למלך על כל הארץ, ביום ההוא, ביום ההוא, יהיה אדוני אחד, ושמו, ושמו, ושמו אחד. You may be seated. As we take some time, um, typically, you know, when we have a B'nai Mitzvah, a child will be standing with us and, um, and we get to pass the Torah from generation to generation. And we say, I typically say, this didn't get here for no reason. This was because of so many choices that so many ancestors of yours made. And we can never account for all of those twists and turns of life and who made what decision where and when and why, yet here we are. So Mourner's Kaddish is our opportunity to say thank, thank you to our, to our ancestors, to praise those blessed choices they made, though they may have been difficult, to steer the way towards this Jewish path as a sacred one, though. And for that, we are so grateful. And um, we stand on the shoulders of many important people. That's how we're here. That's how we stand together. And tonight, in the period of Shiva, if you are joining us during um, the seven days after having lost someone you love, if you'll please stand so we can recognize your loss. Our congregation has suffered the loss in the last 30 days, the Shloshim of David Kotlin, Sandy Tizer, Morlene Sanford, Carol Lee, and Sue Cohn. You can rise whenever you hear your loved one's name um, read tonight. And if you're joining us during the 11-month period after having lost someone that you love, please feel free to stand right now. You can even add their name to the chat box. And tonight is the yard site, the anniversary of the following loved one's deaths. Irving Barkin, Bertha Greenberg Barnett, Clara Barr, Sarah Becker, Adolf Ira Botnik, Ivor Eaton, Elizabeth Eaton, Donald Urkis, Julia R. Feibel, Miriam Fisher, we remember Bernice Fishman, Eva L. Friedman, Marshall Glickman, Virginia Gold, Jack Goodman, Eve Goodman, Abraham E. Gordon, Rose Hillelson, Harold Kane, Edith Komarovsky, Sanford Kravitz, Gertrude Lewin, Evelyn F. Linick. We remember Solomon Loeb, Carolyn Myers Loeb, Caroline Markman, Robert Marks, Lila Jean Kinsey Masters, Robert Bob Masters, Dan Merkin, Jolana Oster, Stanley Plotnick, Marion May Princer, Jack A. Rose, Florence Rubin, Ursula Shedler, Lynn R. Schmidt, Louis Silverman, Mark Jeffrey Satomer, Zella Spira, Florence Stern, Joseph Schoenthal Summer, Betty Targ, Harry Traeger, Samuel Tuckerman, and Belle Guillory Unger. If there are any additional names that you would like to add to the chat box, and we ask you to stand along with every other person who mourns, and we stand collectively as a people to mourn all of those who we have lost and who may need us to say Kaddish Yatom for them as we begin together. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yitzgadal v'yitzgadash shamei rabba. 
Beo ma di vrachi rutevi am lich malchute. Bechai chon of yom echon of chayet echo beit Israel. Bagala uvisman kariv imru amen. Yehesh me rabba me vorach leo lamolo me omaya. Yit barach, yit tabach, yit paar, yit roman, yit nase. Yit adar, yit alev, yit halal, shme de kudsha brichu. Le ela min kol birchata vishirata. Tush bechata venechemata. Da amiran be olma vi imru, amen. Yehe, shlama rabba min shamaya. Bechaim alenu vi al kol Yisrael vi imru, amen. Ose shalom bim romad. Hu ya ase shalom. Aleinu ve'al kol Yisrael ve'imru. Amen. May you be blessed. Zichornam livracha. May their memories be always a blessing to you. And we say, Amen. Please be seated. So friends, I, um, I hope you can see my Simcha Torah flags behind me. I'd be waving and dancing. Um, <laughs> so if you have something sweet, please, a lot of people wonder. <laughs> uh, please join me on the special Shabbat and festival Kiddush. Baruch Adonai Eloheinu Melech Olam Borei Puriyag Amen Baruch Adonai Eloheinu Melech Olam Asher Bachar Banu Mikol Am Vermamad Mikol Asham Vikidishanu B'mitzvotav Atitain Lanu Adonai Eloheinu Be'ava Shabbatot Limnucha Umoadim Lesimcha Chagim Uzmanim Lesasson Et Yom Hashmini Chag Hatzer Tazay Zman Simcha Tainu Mikra Kodesh Zecher Letziat Mitzrayim Kivan I think we all need to sing out a hearty Mazel Tov and Simitov. Simitov, Mazel Tov, Mazel Tov. Yes, and taking the good example of Tamarack and Kathy, if you have somebody nearby to give you a hug or kiss, the name it's but then go for it. And just know that the rest of us are just mm -hmm. you know, hugs and kisses virtually. Mm -hmm. uh, tomorrow, I know the festivities Aww. are already starting in some households, but tomorrow morning, Shabbat morning and festival service, including Yisker, because it is the last day of the holiday according to the Reform calendar and in Israel. So we'll be having a little Hallel, some festive psalms, a little Torah study, and then um, we'll be having this memorial prayer. Um, there's not going to be any meditation because of Yisker tomorrow, and we will not have Musar this week, but we'll be resuming in the next week or two, so stand by for that. Um, what a beautiful, beautiful service. Thank you, Cantor Moses. Thank you, Beata. Thank, Thank you, you, Rabbi Mars. Uh, unbelievable. I'm, I teared up a few times. And I just want to be able to take you off of mute 
and wish each other a Shabbat Shalom and a Mazel Tov and a Chag Samoyach. Thank you for being here, everyone. Shabbat <laughs> Shalom. Hugs, everyone. Bye, Lalai. 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 Bye,